you had mentioned to me there there's really a few key things that should be gathered on every claim by by whoever's running that job and you mentioned a few things like data loss peril etc so let's get into those what are the what are the three or four critical things that need to be gathered and, and why sure so number one and this is always missed you have to have a covered peril okay um covered meaning how do you know whether it's covered or not you have to have a date because there's a policy, you know, foreseeably there's a policy that, you know, renews on an annual basis and you don't know whether it renews in July or January. So what is your date? You have to determine the date of, and what is your peril? So once you determine the date and the peril, then you have a covered peril. Is it, is it hail? Is it wind? Is it hail and or wind? And then is it covered? You have to determine that by data loss. Very simple, but missed all the time. Um, I think you know every roofing contractor should have uh, access to you know, some sort of weather uh, reporting data and, and know the information on that property before they even engage with you know the client about a potential claim. Right. Um, once, if you don't know, then you have to do some investigative work to figure that out. Maybe talk to the neighbors. But you, you, you can't tell them what their date of loss is, but you can present them with information and, and ask them if that helps them determine what the date of loss is and what the covered peril was. Um, next would be you got to get the policy. Once you know what your covered peril is, you got to get the policy or a copy of the policy so you know what coverages are available there or your policyholder does. Or if you run into trouble, you can call a public adjuster or an attorney and have that policy available. There's so many times I get the call and they're discussing what coverage is the carrier's offering. And I need to see the full policy to determine what's available and if they're being fair in that offer. So that's the next thing. Once you have a covered peril, you know what the data loss is. You need to ask the insurer to pull the policy. Usually they don't have it. It's usually a declarations page. You know, if it's under 30 pages, I can tell you that's not the full policy. Um, you have to get the full policy in effect at the time of that loss. So if it's two years ago, they call the agent, they have to ask for last year's policy or the year before that, um, or just specifically ask for the one in effect at that date so we can get the, co the coverages that are at issue or the exclusions that are at issue or the deductible that's at issue. You know what you're up against when you get the copy of the policy. Nine times out of 10, the insured has never seen a full copy of their policy, even if they've been insured for 20 years. They only ever receive a declarations page, which is just a summary cliff notes of what the policy is or what's changing in it, being added or taken away. And it doesn't tell you really anything. So get a copy of the policy, number two. Number three, you have to do what I do, what I would call like the CSI effect, uh, some sort of crime scene investigation. But really, this is a this is a damage uh, scene investigation. So you have to do some sort of investigative work. Um, Oftentimes, like I said, to determine the date of loss even. But if that's your date of loss and you know, you're know you in a position where you've reviewed it and found that you've taken photographs of this full replacement is warranted, well, wouldn't it behoove uh, the roofing contractor to go and talk to the properties northeast, south, and west of that insured to find out if they received a roof replacement from that time? What was their date of loss? All that information is healthy. You know, there's no bit of, you know, there's no quest bad question in that scenario. Ask to see if they've got pictures of the hail from the day. Ask to see if, uh, you know, uh, any of the cars outside got damaged by that. Um, do you have photographs of that? And, and be inquisitive um, to try and get as much information because the policyholder has it. 